YouTube, it's my smile wow, and I'm here to do a quick comparison on weave caps. So I have three weave caps here. So one from Annie, one from Magic, and one from Q Fit. So the Q Fit one I've taken out of the package. Um, the reason I want to do this uh, comparison video on these is they all look pretty much the same. Like they're made out of, they call them mesh, but I call it net. Looks like net, net on her head. You can see it there and here in the picture. So, all right, so I'm going to start with this one. It's called the Q Fit. And what does it say? It says comfortable elastic band and net, ultra stretch, and that it's a closed top. And I use these for making crochet wigs. Now, this one, it shows like it's super stretchy. You know, if you got a big head, you don't have to anything to worry about. Shows the mesh. Like, all right. And I believe this one I got at my local beauty supply store for $1.99 for the cute fit one. This one that is magic was also $1.99. But I ordered this one online at Sam's Beauty. And it's a weaving cap. My light is kind of bright. All right, I think that's good. But it, it's also mesh, closed dome, elastic around it. All right, so that's that one. And then the third one, I ordered this from Sam's Beauty for a dollar, and it's from Annie. And it's the same closed top with the mesh. You can see the mesh here, and it's called a weaving cap. So weaving cap, weaving cap. wig and weave cap all right so i'm gonna start with my least favorite one my least favorite one would be these two right here the magic and the q fit weave cap and the reason i took this one out is because it's exactly the same as this one and that is this cap right here so actually i'm gonna hold them both up and this is the one that's here, the Annie one. That's this one. So this is the Annie one. And this is the Q Fit and the Magic one. They look, you know, look the same, whatever. But this one looks bigger. This one looks smaller. The base on this one, just out the package, I'm not putting any tension or anything on that. But you see how wide that is. This one out the package is considerably smaller and there's a reason for that. So for this one, and this is the Q fit in the magic has your elastic band here, you know, pretty wide and it gives you some stretch here. Now this mesh is not made from like elastic fiber. It has some give to it. But it's definitely not stretchy. Not like it appears to be here on this package. On this package, when I look at this, it looks like this entire cap is just going to stretch as far as I need it to. The band stretches, but this only goes but so far. Because this mesh part is not made out of elastic. But yes, it will fit your head. I have a hat on because my hair looks a hot mess underneath. So I'm just going to show you that it fits your head and I have a large head so it fits no problem now for wearing like a wig or whatever that's cool but I'm using them for purposes of making um, crochet units now this one looks a lot smaller and then you have your band here your elastic band but this one stretches out just as far as that one The net on this has give. So this net stretches. These holes go from like tiny to large. That's the reason why I like this cap from Annie. It's cheaper, it's only a dollar, and it gives me the stretch that I need. Now, the reason I need this to be stretchy like the net to be stretchy is because I have some hair 
that I'm using to make crochet wigs, like the twisted, the tantalizing twist braid. I just dropped that on the floor. This cap that doesn't, that's not made out of elastic here. I can't put bulky pieces of hair through it. Like the twists that I was going to make a, a crochet wig with does not fit through here because these holes have no give at all. It will fit through here because these holes stretch as wide, not as wide as I need them to go, but they stretch considerably and I will be able to get a piece of hair through there that is bulkier. So I'm just going to grab the unit that so I've started. I started this unit and this is a Q-fit cap. The wig weave Q-fit cap that doesn't have any stretch through the through the body. So I tried to um, make my crochet unit with the twist. Wouldn't even fit through the loops here. So then I decided, okay, that's not going to work. So if I'm going to make a unit, it's going to have to be with hair that's not thick. And this is Carol Curl from Free Trust. And as you can see, the pieces are really small. They're thin. That's the only type of hair I'm going to actually be able to use with this cap is pieces of hair that are thin that are going to be able to fit through the holes. So I have this one, this one, and this one. So I have three of these caps total and I do have hair that will work with it. But as far as bulky hair, braids, twists, I'm going to have to stick with the Annie cap, which is cheaper anyway, and it doesn't matter if the hair is thin like this or if the hair is thick, this cap is going to work. So this one I will stick with, and this one I got from Sam's Beauty for $1. And I just want to show you guys um, what it would look like trying to crochet the twist braid into this cap that doesn't have any elastic you know, elastic stretch to it. Has some give, yes, but no stretch. I'm gonna show you that in one moment. All right, so I'm back. So I have the weave cap, mesh cap here. I have the twist and my latch hook. So I'm gonna to try to do this without knocking this computer thing over. All right, so let me just actually do it on top so take my twist and you see that put it on a latch hook close the latch hook and fight to get this through yeah so that fell apart <laughs> So this does not have any give to put a braid through. So I'm going to take this off and I'm going to use my anti cap, which is the one that appears to be smaller. Alright, so I have it on my little mannequin. And it is quite snug on her head. Alrighty. So again, latch hook. That in. Give me a little piece of hair. Latch it on. Close the loop. And it goes through the any cap. So I'm able to get that twist on that cap where this one, this one, these two caps, the Q-Fit and then the Magic cap does not work well for doing crochet styles of hair where you have a bulky piece of hair. This Annie, where's my Annie cap? All right here. Annie cap works for chunky pieces of hair when you're trying to make a crochet style all right so that is my video thanks for watching